Hey, I'm Skyler. If you're trying to synchronize photos from iTunes to your phone and you're not seeing any albums in iTunes, it's because you haven't created them in iPhoto. So let's go over the process of creating an album in iPhoto and then syncing it to your iPhone. It'll take us probably two minutes. So I'm looking at iPhoto now and I've got a bunch of images that I think I'd like to put together into an album. So I'm going to select those images individually. And I'm going to do that by clicking on one of them, say this one. And then I'm going to hold down the command key and click on another one, say this one. I'm going to scroll up a little bit and find another one. The dog. Hold down command and click that one. So now we can see that I've got three images, one, two, three, all highlighted. If I click add to in the lower right hand side of the window, I can create an album right here. So I create the album and I'm going to call it something new. I'll do demo 2. Obviously you can name it whatever you want. All right, we're actually halfway there. I'm going to go to iPhoto now, or rather iTunes. And in iTunes, click on my iPhone at the top here. I've already got sync photos engaged. Now, for me, it says aperture. For you, it'll say iPhoto. They're the same thing. The albums are actually shared back and forth between aperture and iPhoto interchangeably. Down here, I see Demo 2, the album I just created. I'm just going to select that, and it would show me how many photographs were in it. Then I click Apply, and it moves the photos to the iPhone. Simple as that. Thanks for watching. I'm Skyler.